Well, hello again everybody. I'm Gary Cutlack for Tech Digest and Shiny Shiny. And um, this week's video is about batteries and those home recharging techniques we use ourselves to try and bring a dead battery back to life. Now, I'm sure you've been there. You're sitting at home watching telly and your remote control stops working because the batteries have died. So what do you do? Do you go out and buy some new batteries? Of course you don't. What you do is you take the take the back off the battery compartment and try jiggling them about a bit. Or maybe you take them out, swap them around and see if that works. Or you might you might blow on them for a bit to see if warming them up somehow brings them back to life. Anything, anything to carry on watching telly without having to go and find something else that takes the same size of batteries you can take out and put in your remote control. But do any of these tests actually work? Let's find out. I've identified three areas that we use. Area number one, warming them up. Area number two, jiggling them about. And area number three, the reversal. But do they work? Well, let, let, let's find out, shall we? Let's start with number one, warming them up, because warming them up is going to require a bit of uh, advanced planning. Oh, now, I've got here some fully drained, entirely dead AA batteries. So I'm going to warm them up. Now, I think the best way to warm them up is to probably put them down my pants. So, I'll do that. I'll put one battery either side. And they're really quite extraordinarily cold. It's not very pleasant. Right, let's hope they don't leak or explode. Okay, right, they're, they're, they're warming up now. So let's try um, number two, jiggling them about. Does jiggling batteries about actually make them work? Well, I don't know. Let's see. I've got here my um, old-fashioned little Game Boy Advance. Obviously, I've got a new uh, Game Boy uh, a, a DS Lite. Um, I'll only, I only, only keep this as a keepsake of the old days. It's not my main gaming machine or anything. Um, but the, the batteries in it are drained. As you can see, it doesn't work at all. But will it start working if we jiggle the batteries about? Well, let's find out. Well, obviously I'm going to jiggle them really hard. And I'm going to jiggle them really furiously to make sure they're really very well jiggled. I mean, it doesn't say anything on the batteries about do not jiggle. So, I can only assume it's perfectly safe to do so. I'm really, really, really jiggle them so that you know. I don't want anyone accusing me of not jiggling them properly and reading the test. Well, that's that. I think that's, that's as jiggled as they're going to get, frankly. I'm bored, I'm bored of that already. Um, and let's see, let's see if it works. No. No, it doesn't work. Oh, well, no, there's a, there's a slight, a slight glimmer. But nothing enough to be worthwhile or usable. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna just say that jiggling them about is a failure. Um, so number three is the reversal. Now, I've got here a pair of quite exotic, um, for people in the UK anyway. Um, Radio Shack AA batteries. I'm going to put them in. Now I, I've pre-drained them. I pre-drain all my batteries for these tests. So there you go. Doesn't work at all. But what about if you put them in the other way around? Now here's the battery that's in first. I'll put that one in the bottom. 
effectively swapping them around. No, 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 no tricks there. I don't want to fool you. This is science. Ah, well, there you go. And that's a failure for the reversal technique. So that's two, two failures so far for home recharging. That's very disappointing. But what about area number one, warming them up? Is there some sort of chemical reaction going on in my pants right at this very moment? Well, let's see. Right. <laughs> They're really quite really quite very warm very warm indeed I didn't realize it got so hot down there so that's quite fantastic Could probably boil an egg down there okay so can you charge batteries up just by putting them down your underpants no you can't well, that's really disappointing. I was hoping you would, because then it would have been a lot funnier and a lot more amusing. Um, whereas in actual fact, it's just been a big waste of time. Um, so if your batteries go flat, don't bother mucking about with them. Um, just get some new batteries. That's, that's my consumer advice for today. The end. <laughs>